Hello, I'm Ninta. I'm a live 2D Liga and artist. In this video, I'll introduce my new hair zigzag making. Ninta live 2D and art. One, having the deformer. First of all, I'll make a wave deformer to wrap each hair strand. All tan block narrows the values using the center as a fulcrum. Then I change the shape of the wave deformer along the hair strand. By using temporary pass deformation shortcut key is Ctrl B. I want you should change the deformer shape without wrapping hair strand because the original hair image is winded with wrapping deformer. Making a hair zigos. Your point one duplicate deformers. The I duplicate the deformer second times by Ctrl C and Ctrl V. To assign each copied deformer to one X and one Y parameters, you should make each deformer size expand by Shift Ctrl Alt Drag for making the wrapping deformer larger than the wrapped deformer. Now there are three same deformer were made. As the first deformer, I made one more deformer without changing shape. Why params make hair jiggle when the model's head moves particular directions? Each parameter has value like these, minimum 1, default 0, max 1. Then I connect this deformer to y jiggle parameters. Your point to reading y for hair jiggle. At first time, the most inner deformer is connected with y for parameters. I make y jiggle over the end part of the hair. Regarding y jiggle parameters, generally minus value is outward extending motion, and plus value is inward shrinking motion. I'm making motion by using temporary to like before. This is rigging process. The point to rigging Y3 here is go. Next, I add the Y3 parameter to the deformer one level above the Y4 parameter. The Y3 parameter makes middle part here as jiggle. I make motion by using temporary pass through again. Rigging process again. The point for we in white hair zigo. Then I add white parameter to the deformer one more level above and making motion like before. Digging. The point card begin Y1 here as you. The outermost deformer makes hairs vertical bounding motions. I change the deformer shape by using a temporary pass through again. Rigging. The much X Y hair zigo hair physics settings. Now I finish the hair Y zigo, so I check motions on the physics settings tabs. 
I set up physics input and output values like these captions. And here physics pendulum like this. Three making x hair jiggles. Three point one leading x four hair jiggle. In order to make hair x jiggle, I did use the deformer I made before. But first, I add the y four parameter to the deformer. Already have y four parameter. Now I add the motions on the end of the hair part. Regarding hair x parameters, value plus is swinging right and minus is swinging left. Rigging process. Three point two rigging x three hair zigu. Next, I add the x three parameter to the deformer. Already have y three parameter. I make motion swing left and right on the middle part of the hair. Rigging process. Three point two rigging x two hair zigu. I'll start the X2 parameter to the deformer having Y2 parameter. And I, and I make motion on the root part of the hair. Rigging. Three point four being x one hair zero. At the last, I add the x one parameter to the deformer having y one parameter. But for this deformer, I make motions intent to add the curling the whole hair rigging. Three point five x hair jiggle physics settings. I also finished making hair x jiggle, so I connect physics settings. The hair x jiggle's values are like this. Or she's sizing corners x, y. Both direction jiggle were made. Finally, I synthesize parameters corners. I synthesize each x and y hair jiggle parameters to make smooth hair motions. I'm synthesizing corners. Now I completed two synthesizers from 1 to 4 XY parameters. I finished all of the process to rig the hair jiggle in the new method. Fine, result. I check the result on physics tab by using external application integrations, connecting live to DKVism and the bridge of studio tracking. I 
I finished this hair tutorial. Thank you for watching my video. I have an individual site, Live2D3, uploading some Live2D posts. You can study about Live2D in this site. Please join this site. I put on the link in this video's description.